case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the 1998 case, Valley Total Fitness Holding Corp v. Faber, the United States District Court for the Central District of California, considered whether First Amendment rights to free speech and expression could outweigh trademark protection and determined that non-commercial use of trademarks, such as criticism or art, is generally allowed. Valley Total Fitness sued Andrew Faber over his negative use of their trademarks on his website, Valley Sucks, alleging trademark infringement, unfair competition, and dilution. However, the court denied Bally's motion for summary judgment and ordered Faber to bring his own motion. Faber did so, and the court granted his motion, focusing on the lack of potential confusion, the non-competitive nature of Faber's website, and its intended purpose as consumer criticism. Ultimately, the court ruled that Faber's use of Bally's marks in this context was protected by the First Amendment as non-commercial expression. Consequently, it rejected Bally's claims of trademark infringement, unfair competition, and dilution, and granted summary judgment in favor of Faber on all counts. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.